Every single time I've tried to make a video, it just hasn't worked out. Like today, I was so keen on filming a video, but I could not find my tripod anywhere. I grabbed my camera, I went to go look for my tripod, tripod just took a vacation like Guatemala, it's not coming back, and I'm just... Hey guys, my name is Ashley, and welcome to a new video on my channel. So I already tried filming this video, but like, the world hates me, so I never got to upload it. So I'm going to be reading from my fourth grade diary. So whenever I opened up my journal, this was the first thing that fell out. It's a picture of my friend Maddie. We've been friends since like kindergarten. Like she was the first friend that I made whenever I moved. We've been in touch ever since. We've known each other for like years now. And I guess for like a Christmas card or birthday card or something, she included a picture of herself. So you know what I mean? Now I have it in my notebook, it's there. So then the next thing we have here is a bunch of stuff that I doodled. Oh my God, okay, so I used to be obsessed with American Girl dolls. So I have like little doodles, like, there's this one doll that I had and her name was Lainey and she she was like the nature lover doll thing. I guess I did a doodle of her and it says like, go green and like. <laughs> then here's another doodle and it just says, I heart animals at the bottom and that's just like so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is freaking amazing. Okay, so here's this little short story time. Whenever I was in third grade, I used to be obsessed with this series called Warrior Cats and I still have like a ton of the books. There's like 20 some books in the series and they're all like about 300 pages long and there are some that are like, 500 pages long, but I was obsessed with those from like third grade to sixth grade and I used to read them like all the time and I was freaking obsessed. And at recess during third grade, my friends and I would like play warrior cats and pretend to be the like, characters. So basically role play, which is really weird, but you know, what do you do when you're in third grade, right? There was this little boy, but his name was Jeffrey and he was like my best friend. And we used to talk all the time. And it was so much fun because there's this one day where he was at recess alone and I was like, hey, didn't you come play with my friends? And I, and he was like, yeah, sure. And then we played at recess together. So for class, a few weeks later, we had to write people letters. So he wrote me a letter. Thanks for letting me play wars with you when I had nothing to play, I really appreciate it. And then he said, that was such a nice thing to do. The game was really fun. I'm so sorry it had to be canceled, but maybe if we don't invite any more people, we can continue to play the game. See you at recess, sincerely, Jeffrey. I don't even know why I still have this, but it's one of those things that I just like kept and it's just, yeah. I just found two different slips of paper that have like people's phone numbers on here. I don't know whose numbers they are because I don't have their names written down, but we're gonna prank call them. These are obviously people that I know and I normally don't prank call people because it's not, I don't really like doing that, but I just wanna do this and see how this goes. I didn't block my number. Make sure you, whenever you're prank calling people that use star 67. <laughs> my dog is just watching me from the top of the stairs. It's really creepy. <laughs> I'd like a small pepperoni pizza. Pardon? Oh, I just want a small pepperoni pizza. This is Domino's, right? Uh, you had the right number? Oh, I guess not. I don't know. I just found this number. I don't think so. I'm sorry. All right. Have a good day. <laughs> Somebody must have given me their number, but then it ended up being the wrong number. We have a picture of a dog. I know, right? And then I said it rained today, and I, I spelled rain wrong. And that's a drawing that I made. And I said, I'm a mermaid. And then here's a picture of a dog and Hannah Montana is written across. Because I used to be the most hardcore Hannah Montana. This, oh, okay. So I used to be obsessed with Hannah Montana, like I was just saying. And apparently I wrote my own version of Best of Both Worlds, but it was like Christmas version. <laughs> Everybody, buy my mixtape coming out December 25th. for its true purpose. I wonder what that could be. It says, remember how I used to like blank? Well, after a lot of thinking, I decided to stop wasting my time with him. Now I fell for, okay, I can't say his name because like, I know for a fact that he watches my videos now. So we're just gonna call him Steve, okay? Now I fell for Steve, the boy that's in front of me in class. Jeffrey was replaced and now we have Steve all up in here trying to get a piece of this. 
I was so over dramatic when I was younger. Let's like not even get into that. I was so over dramatic about everything. <laughs> it's 10:47 and I can't sleep or stop thinking about him. Oh my god. I was really boy crazy when I was younger, which is funny. I wrote, sorry it's been so long. I found out Steve likes me. Oh my god, I'm so excited. My friend Jessica, her and I are still friends now. I know she's watching, so hi Jess. Anyway, what I said was, dear diary, Jessica is so proud of me. You know why? Because Steve is a total jerk. He ignores me, and Jessica says he tries to get away from me, so I don't like him. Okay, here's a picture of my fourth grade math teacher. <laughs> my handwriting was really bad. Just like, look at this. Like, you can't even read it. Dear diary, oh dear, I was just reading this whole thing and I want to puke. I'm in sixth grade now. Steve and I dated for a week, broke up one week and one day later. Hello, hell. Now I kind of like Jonathan. We're friends for now, but guess who else he's friends with? Steve! Mind blown! Jessica wrote an entry and it says, Dear Ashley's Diary, it's Jesse here. Me and Ashley decided to have me write down something to laugh at later, so here it is. La la la, Ashley hates Steve. I'm so proud of her, but now I'm disappointed because she likes Jonathan and she shouldn't like anybody. She asked me who the cutest boy was from fourth grade and I said, the male rock. Ha! Okay, today Daquan put his arm around me when I was picking out my lunch and I was all like, what? And I shoved his arm off me. Apparently everybody likes Daquan, but I think he's stupid and ugly. I don't know what others even see in him. To finish off this video, I'm gonna go ahead and recite another song my friend Jessica wrote in my journal. Hey, hi Jonathan, he is awesome. I'm gonna have Jonathan, oh yeah. La 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 la, I love Jonathan, he's awesome. But he just has to be friends with Steve. I hate Steve, he's stupid. I don't know why I ever liked him. And how I'm going to swim lessons, la la la. I hope Jonathan is practicing too so I can see his muscles. I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, subscribe for more future videos, and go ahead and check out all my social media links down below. And yeah, I think that's pretty much all I have to say, so. Bye. <laughs>